What's up guys? Welcome to the channel or welcome back to the channel. If you are new here, I'm Tatum and today I'm going to be doing a new puppy haul. So if you know me or follow the channel, you know that Rob and I have a lab who actually today is 10 months. Her name is Sunny. She's a yellow lab and we love her so, so much that we're getting another puppy. We're getting a mini dachshund on Sunday. Her name is going to be Princess Vanellope Von Schweetz. I am over the moon and so excited to get her. So I have all of these packages of everything that I ordered for her. So I'm so excited to go through all these packages. Her color scheme is pink with a little bit of green in there, but I am so excited to show you all the things that have come so far. There are a few things that haven't come yet in the mail, but a majority of the things have. And the things that haven't come yet, which are kind of important, her collar, leash, and harness haven't come yet, and then some random clothes that I ordered her and some other, you know, just random blankets and items like that. So let's get right into it with this box from Chewy. So this is her bed, not the bed that's going to go in her crate, but just another bed. We know Sunny loves her beds. She has one in the bedroom, one in her crate, and one in our office. So I got this bed for Sweet, which I hope she's going to love because she can kind of like nest in here. That was the goal. Seems like Sunny likes it as well. And then I got this bed to go inside of her crate. So this goes in the bottom and then if something happens, then you wash it. I'm gonna pull that out. Sunny is beyond interested in the packages here. So this is what that looks like. <laughs> All right, so those are the little bed items that we have. Let me go to, oh, these came today from Amazon. Hey, Sun, stop. These little booties, Sunny has booties and she hates them, but I'm thinking because Schweetz is a tinier dog and they say they don't like weather, um, she'll want to wear them so her paws aren't like on the cold ground. So they're so sweet and tiny and Sunny's trying to eat them. But yeah, those came today from Amazon and they're also light reflectant. So if we go on a walk at night, she'll be seen. So I got this anxiety solution little toy. So basically what it does is it has this heartbeat so that the dog like feels like it's laying near like it's mom or something. Um, so I plan on putting batteries in that and putting it in her bed to sleep at night. That's there. I also got her this tiny little sweater, which I thought was super cute from Amazon. It's just fleece. Can I help you? Okay, let's open this. I believe this is the gate that I got. A little like play pen gate situation because I'm hoping to have Schweetz in the office with me, like have her contained in there, but allow Sunny to go other places. So I tried to get like a short one. Is this yeah, this is the gate. Okay. Yeah, she's definitely tall enough to get over that. All right, next up is her crate. So, I'm gonna try to open this without hurting myself, which is just going to be an experiment in and of itself. Pink crate, which was 
just the hardest package to get open that I've ever experienced in my life. And believe me, I've opened a lot of packages. So, like I said, I'll probably do a video on getting the apartment ready and putting everything together. I think this should just pop up, but if it's anything like it's packaged, it's gonna take me five hours to figure out. So yeah, that's her crate. Oh yes, this is her little rain jacket, which I just thought was so sweet. And like I said, with the weather stuff, hey, I was worried about her getting cold, so protecting her from the rain and snow that happens here very often. Next up, Sunny is gonna walk these, but this is actually Sunny, sit. This toy actually is for Sunny. It's an alligator, but she'll be getting it the day that Sweets comes home so she doesn't go bonkers, you know? And then we also have this little chew toy rope. And then finally this little turtle. Not finally anything because there's still more stuff in this package and in the other boxes. But uh, I got this urine destroyer from Target because apparently you want to destroy the scent after they pee somewhere in the house. Otherwise, like they'll smell their own pee and they'll be like, oh, it's cool for me to pee here, even though it's not. So I got this to try to combat that. Oh yes, this is her water bowl. So it's cute marbled and I think it should be short enough for her to be able to get into it. So I got that from Chewy. Most things I ordered are from Chewy, Amazon, or Target. Those are the main places. If it's clothes, it's probably from Etsy. Um, then I got these nail trimmers also from Chewy because it seems like her nails are translucent so I should be able to see and not harm her when I'm trimming her but I plan on taking her to the groomers for the first few times um, before I do trim them myself but it seems like it's gonna need to happen kind of often so I'm hoping I can learn myself all right, so okay. I also got this slow feed bowl, but I don't think she's big enough to use it yet. They say that dachshunds try to eat their food really fast, and Sunny actually has a slow feed bowl too, um, just to prevent them from like gobbling down their food and then having stomach pain. So I did get one, but will we end up using it right away? Probably not because she's just too tiny. Next up, I just got a scoop to scoop her food out of the container that I will show you later. Sunny is just so interested in all of these items, but it seems like so anti-puppy YouTube to not have her in this video, but she is a distraction for sure. Um, next up is the food bag that I got for sheets. So I ordered Diamond Naturals Small Breed Puppy Chicken and Rice Formula. All right, we had a minor interlude because the heat started and now it's done again. So let's get back to it and see the training treats that I bought. These are the ones that they said on the internet were good because you can give them a lot of them and they're not gonna get fat, which I guess you really have to worry about with dachshunds because it hurts their back when they're too heavy. So she won't be getting any table food like Sunny does sometimes because she begs so very much. But it seems like we can't do that with sweets. So I got these mini naturals plus vitamins and minerals, wholesome tender mini bites for all your adventures and training. These are the salmon recipe because I know that <laughs> Sunny likes salmon and Every time I give Sweets a treat, I'm probably gonna have to give Sunny a treat too. So these are the training treats that I bought. Then I got Sweets this tiny little duck toy. It's so cute. Also from Chewy. And then these two toys, Sunny has one of these, um, like a big one, but this is like a tiny little one. And they do make these little discs that you can put inside of them for the dogs to eat. Um, but they didn't have any in the extra small size. 
And then I got this tiny little rope pull thing from the same brand because we do have some toys for Sunny from this brand and we really like it. And I'm just trying to find like small things for her because she is like the size of, like smaller than a wine bottle. Like she is tiny, tiny. So that's what's in that box. Then in this box, I got this container, which has another container inside of it for her food. So Rob has one of these for Sunny's food and I thought it was a really good idea. So I got the same thing for sweets. So it's two containers and the big one's gonna have her food. I'm not sure what I'm gonna put in the little one yet, but I loved that it came as a pack of two, obviously in her signature pink color. It also comes with this scoop, but it's a four cup scoop, which is just massive. Like that's why I bought the other scoop because she's only eating a half cup of food at a time. So I didn't think it was necessary to have that scoop. So first off, I got this tote from Target, which I plan on having her sleep in, actually, obviously not with the top on, um, for the first few weeks. Rob said with Sunny and his parents' previous dogs, what they did was had a container like this, put a bunch of blankets and warm things in it, and then slept with their hand over the side of the bed, like in the container, because she's obviously going to be like missing her mom, missing her brothers and sisters. So really trying to make that like warm, cuddly environment alongside the little toy that has the heartbeat. Um, I also ordered a heating pad, which isn't here yet, but I bought two of these blankets from Spritz, which I love Spritz. These were $10 each and in this like spring pattern, basically what I plan on doing is putting one of the Spritz blankets down, then putting the heating pad on the next layer, then the blanket and then putting her there. Um, just so it's like a nice little warm bed because right now they have them sleeping underneath like a warm heat lamp and so I think she's gonna be kind of cold here. That's why I bought all the clothes alongside the fact that they're all really cute. Um, but yeah, just trying to make a little warm environment for her. And then what else did I get? Oh, I got this bundle of towels for $10. I thought it was a really good deal. Like two like full-size towels and then two smaller towels. I'm sure she's going to be making like a huge mess everywhere. We have to use like one or two towels a week for Sunny just because she gets like her paws wet, like walking outside or when she showers, we have to use multiple towels. So, well, not when she showers, like when we bathe her, we have to use multiple towels. So I figured it would just be a good idea to have more in the house. So that's that. Then, I got this container. It's just a clear like stackable bin that they have from the Bright Room brand. That's what I plan on bringing her home in. So I'm just gonna put some of the blankets in here and bring her home in that. Then while Miss Bun is distracted, I got this toy which has like little squirrels in it. And you can like pull them up them back in, all that. So that's for the both of them. And then I got this tiny, tiny little food bowl. It has like a sloped edge. Um, so I'm thinking this is what she's probably gonna use for the first like three or four months. It's actually like a cat bowl. <laughs> um, but yeah, probably gonna use that for a little bit. And then last for the toys, I got this Frisbee for both the girls. I think it'll be a really fun exercise for them. So I thought that was cute. Also from Target. So that's all from that box. And I believe there's only one thing left. From Wild One, which I'm so excited. I spent a lot on this carrier, but I think it's gonna be really, really nice. 
It is a green travel carrier. Smells brand spanking new. I plan on bringing her home with me, so she'll need to fly on the airplane, and I think this will be the perfect little carrier for her. It was more expensive, but I mean, she needs to be safe, so. And with my purchase, I got a free tennis ball and some free poop bags. Obviously, I didn't buy any poop bags because we already had them for Sunny, and they're the same for Sweets. Um, no, no. And then for my birthday, also from Wild One, Rob bought me a treat pouch. So it's basically like a fanny pack with a compartment for treats and then a compartment for the poop bags. I hate the way the poop bags smell in my jacket right now. What are you eating? Um, I hate the way the poop bags smell in my jacket right now, so I'm really excited for the treat bag. And then I also had him get me the carrier bag from Wild One so that she can poke her head out and come shopping with me. So that is a majority of the things that I have purchased for Sweets. I also bought myself a training book so I can train her to be the best pup possible. And I believe that's almost everything. I also bought a crate cover um, so that it creates more of like a den vibe. They say that dachshunds like to, you know, have like their little den and they like to dig and they like to be, you know, all cuddly. So I have that coming and I think some more pajamas and clothes. That's everything from my puppy haul. It's a lot of stuff. Obviously I went way overboard and you don't need all of these things. I probably spent around $500 on all of this stuff, but I just want her to have, you know, the little princess environment because she is a princess and I'm, I love everything that we bought. Um, I'll keep doing vlogs, obviously, and she'll be in them, so you'll see these items featured, and I'll also talk about some of them, you know, as I use them and if I like them. So yeah, make sure to subscribe to the channel, like this video because it gets it out to so many more people, and thanks for watching, guys.